so nobody has taken the internet by storm this year quite like Belle Delphine. Belle Delphine? Belle Delphine. 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 Over 50 people had reportedly contracted herpes after drinking Instagram star Belle Delphine's bath water. 4.4 million Instagram followers, 4,500 Patreons. I spent 2,500 on Belle Delphine's Patreon. But like this video has been made by so many YouTubers. I gave her $2,500 and uh, this is what happened. Guess what? Nothing happened. Eh, uh, shut your face, Mr. Tumnus. We got a very important piece of art out of that donation. Countless articles and YouTube videos, 27 egg yolks and one dead octopus. But who is she? Well, uh, a quick YouTube search will tell you that her real name is actually Belle Kirshner. But all that really does is pull up a 13 year old girl's social media handles, which are, I mean, exactly as you'd expect. I heart Marcus Butler, Alfie Days, and Sam Pepper. Oh God. Youngest swing gymnast. Whoa, all right, Spider Man. Anyway, so I think it's probably best that we start this story a little bit further down the line. But um, before we do that, now I've been watching my Morgs videos recently, and I've learned a trick. So, uh, so what you'll see if you watch a Morgs video recently is he does the 10 second subscribe challenge, where him and Menopausal Mary here give you 10 seconds to, well, subscribe to their channel. <laughs> so we're gonna start doing that too. I, uh, I don't know if this is gonna work on, a, on an audience that isn't a bunch of 10 year olds, but I mean, we'll find out. So if you're sat there watching this video and you're not already currently subscribed, we're gonna set a challenge. <laughs> you have exactly the same amount of time that it takes me to cop some, some lovely 25% off beautiful Will and E merch to subscribe to the channel. Okay, willany.co.uk. Oh, lovely classic black hoodie. Oh, look at all those sizes. Wow, what a range. Let's get a lovely gray beanie to go with that. Uh, oh, what about a backpack? Uh, phone case. Yeah, we'll have that too. Uh, okay, right, cop, nice. Okay, so back to it. Now, if you go on a Facebook, right, that's where this whole thing started. The very first one on here is from 2013. And there's a bunch of interesting pictures that come all the way up to the present day. Oh, a bit of war paint there. Kick ass. I like your style choices. It must be a lot of fun deciding what you are going to do next with so many original variations. Keep them coming. <laughs> Rock on! Yeah, rock on! If you're wondering how she managed to sell out some bath water, um, this is why. I edited Tayu's lol. What, is that the true Geordie? What the frig? Holy gosh. Hang on. Has she got LEDs in her eyebrows? But despite all of these, the first time the Belle Delphine thirst train really started to rear its head was in October of 2018. Now, um, now it's funny that, because there's something else that that came about in October 2018. Hit or miss, I guess they never miss. Now it didn't take long before Belle here was banned from TikTok, presumably for the horrendous dancing, but by that point her Instagram was already through the roof. With everyone rushing to follow the sticky out tongue woman, you're so f***ing cute. Please respond to me once, please. <laughs> Jesus Christ. But uh, maybe even more importantly than that, her Patreon was blowing up too. Like pretty much all of the breakout search terms over this period of time are related to, oh, oh I wanna see the pink haired woman's funny. And that right there, like, that's just money. Now, if you're not familiar with her Patreon, um, <laughs> I am. <laughs> so guess which one we're buying today? Oh, no, we're not, not the gods, no. <laughs> as is my accountant. Uh, hello, Will, uh, I'm just calling you up because there's an expense down here for uh, two and a half thousand dollars worth of lewd photos. Just wondering how we're gonna explain that to the tax man. Now the Patreon packages, they go all the way up to $2,500 per month. So what could you possibly negotiate for that amount of money? Well, one brave YouTube soldier named Winnie, he took one for the team. Hang on. Winnie, Winnie. Michael, honestly, I, I will have no problems kicking your head in. Hello, my name is Indigo White. Okay, and then moving on to a different part of the story, and something I've never touched on is the dark side of Belle Delphine. Let's talk about Belle, Bella, Delphine, whatever her name is. 
this bitch. So uh, she's not been without controversy, right? And there was a YouTuber called Indigo White here, where she goes through this thread of a bunch of screenshots of this guy approaching Belle and being like, oh, help me make a fake catfish account. We'll make loads of money sending pictures to horny old men. And it, and it turns out she's 17 at the time. So he asks her to take them off other girls' tumblers and help him trick the old people that they're hurt. And what she did, right, she stole them off this girl called Minty. Now, obviously, it all goes tits up. Belle then apologizes to this Minty girl, but, uh, but never publicly. And obviously, right, like, you can't do that. Like, obviously, that's scummy. Like, you can't just steal someone else's funny pictures just because you want to go on holiday. But over the last couple of days, I've had, like, a proper good look into it. And, and it kind of really seems like there's two sides to the story. So what I'll do is I'll leave a link to the thread that I'm talking about in the description, right? And feel free to have a look through it and... Let us know if you disagree or if I've missed the mark here. But if you look at the screenshots and the way this guy approaches her, it seems crazy manipulative. Like, if you're really giving her the benefit of the doubt, it does seem like in that situation, she's in a way a little bit of the victim. But again, I've got to say that is my opinion. Uh, feel free to let us know if I've, if I've completely f***ed it. Okay, now that brings us all the way up to the present day. Do you, uh, <laughs> do you see why I'm making this video? Okay, so in June, you see that first spike here? That's for this. If this photo gets 1 million likes, I'll actually make a hub account. Tag your friends and dad to help out. Now, I don't know if he's noticed, but this photo nearly has 2 million likes. So, I mean, she made one and, and uploaded videos such as Belle Delphine strokes two big cocks, which is just her playing with a, with a couple of chickens. Where the f*** she got on them from? Like, what farmer is agreeing to that? What did you say you need them for again? I'm just making a video. Oh, what? For, for YouTube? Um... I'm not quite. Belle Delphine gets double. Oh, I can't say that. Um, anyway, this one's just her putting two cigarettes up her nose. Looks like a Nico Omelon. I thumbnail this. Belle Delphine gets a helping hand. Oh, this seems pretty normal. Bread. Nutella. Knife. I have. Osteoporosis? Belle Delphine gets bl- uh, Jesus Christ. She then puts PewDiePie inside her, covers herself in a cream pie, and then covers herself in a load of Coke and Mentos. And in like the month since she posted all those, she's done 7.8 million views. And according to a help forum, right, that roughly equates to $5,000 just for playing with some chickens and some squirty cream. And then, as I'm sure you are all aware, she started selling her bathwater. I am now selling my bathwater for all you thirsty gamer boys. Check out my new shop where I'm selling stuff for you. 30 quid a pot and all, and she sold it out. She's made Alex look a right mug there. That was his thing. <laughs> like, at this point, right, I swear she's just kind of printing money. Like, because that pot of water is so clout infested that pretty much anyone can bang a video about it if they're brave enough to drink it. Like, I'm sure there's a lot of people out there looking at that and thinking, 30 quid and an SDI for a million views. That's a risk I'm willing to take. Now, since then, there's been a lot of talk that, that she's got the clap. Belle Delphine's bathwater is making people sick. There was also this tweet from Twitter account Daily Mail US. And it said over 50 people had reportedly contracted herpes after drinking Instagram star Belle Delphine's bathwater. Ah, oh, yeah, because uh, cause that's a totally legitimate account. It doesn't even match the act. She then had to come out and be like, oh, lads, no, no, I, I promise I don't have any cold sores on my fanny. Yes, I used to get blisters when there's a change in weather. I've gotten them occasionally since I was a child. I haven't had one in a year or two, and no, you cannot get it. Yep, sounds like a delicacy to me. And then, right, after that, there's been people commenting complaining that there wasn't actually any human DNA in the water at all. Grr, where are my blisters? So there was this Reddit post about it, right? And there's a section of it that reads, since she advertised it as being her bathwater, which it clearly isn't, there might be grounds for a class action lawsuit. If you have a receipt of your purchase, you might be eligible for damages. Like I said, I'm serious. <laughs> Like, can you imagine going to court and explaining to a judge with a straight face that you and your mates are livid because he's all spent $30 on something called Gamer Girl Bathwater and it didn't have any skin cells in there? I give up. I give up. But she didn't give up, though. Belle Delphine, 
I am selling bath water one last time. Except this time, it's enough to drown in. Extreme Gamer Girl Bath Water. How is it extreme? Yeah, lads, uh, <laughs> this one's got super herpes. The thing is, though, this time round, it's $10,000. I will send you a full container of my genuine bath water. I will send you a personal video of me bathing in the tub I send you. Ah! Just came with receipts this time and shipping is free. Oh, thank God. I mean, that's so kind of you, Bell. I mean, the 10 grand isn't an issue, but those Royal Mail handling fees had me stressed. And the thing is, right, it's sold out. Someone's bought it. So, uh, <coughs> I'll see you in the next video. Okay, now, uh, now that was supposed to be the end of the video, right? I was just gonna leave it there and pretend that I'd spent a small fortune on some lass's bath water, but uh, it was a big lie. More importantly though, since we've recorded this video, she's been banned. Belle Delphine's Instagram account is no more. So uh, if you wanna share this image around, you know, try and get the message out to get her back. I'll leave a link in the description. Thank you very much for watching. Please leave a like and subscribe if you're new. Love you loads, bye.